Hello Tread users, welcome back. This will be a shorter episode, but we've done some off-camera grinding and we're going to try out the gym. We should be able to very handily take down these trainers. We did some grinding, got to get up to 15 on my um, 80 slash um, polywag. I think that should be enough to get this. I was also wrong in the last episode. Water Ground has doubled the effectiveness of uh, bubble, so we're going to use water gun instead of bubble, even though bubble can reduce speed. We'll keep it for now because there's nothing to get rid of it for, but still, uh, should be pretty effective there. As we can see here, we're just one-shotting. The Geodudes are apparently super weak against us because they have double weakness from being rock and ground, so we shouldn't have any trouble with those guys. Um, but I remember uh, Roxanne has a nose pass, I believe, so that makes things a little tricky for us, so. Okay, one more and then the gym leader. I'm a little bit nervous. Every time I take on a gym leader, I'm so nervous, but uh, I think we can do it, especially if we get another level under our belts here. I don't really foresee that being too huge of a problem. We can one-shot up to level 11 Geodude, so. We should be able to do that. And we'll get almost another level probably out of that other Geodude when she has it. So, here we go! There goes nothing! Uh, we also have Hypnosis, so I'm going to try and put the Nose Pass to sleep. Just so it does as little damage as possible to us. But we do have a fair pool of health now built up. Given that uh, we've done this grinding, 41 health is pretty decent. Oh yeah, you can one shot that that bitch. Yeah, all right. Hopefully we two shot this. Let's let's give it a try. Okay, not quite that good. Okay, he missed. So we're gonna try and put him to sleep because we're gonna need a couple more rounds to kill him. Then the Geo dudes, the Geo pals, as they say. I hope he's a sleepy nose pass and needs lots of rest. I hope we crit hard. Oh fuck, he woke up. Alright, how much damage does this one do? So we're... Oof. Quite a bit. Alright, let's try and put him to sleep. Yeah, oh god, that's annoying. I don't know how many of those she has. She might have unlimited, kind of, so... Ugh. We need some crits in here too, and we need him to stay asleep a lot longer. Yeah, alright, we're gonna try one more, and then we'll heal after he hits us again, if he hits us again, that is. Okay, one more, come on, one more. She doesn't potion him. Oh, yes, she does. Goodness. We've done, done well so far. Wow. There we go. Woo, baby, a critical hit. What a way to win. Nice, that's exactly what we needed there. And we get up another level. 17 is great because we're only eight away from our evolution, which is awesome. So, sweet. $1,500 too. Oh, we need to go sell that star piece. So we're gonna go do that real quick before I forget. We'll get our Pokemon back. I stored everyone before the start of this episode because it didn't run a risk a full wipe. If we were to wipe, I would rather just lose one Pokemon, so yeah, awesome, sweet. Nice. Alright, so we can give Rock Tomb to C Dot, probably, and he can have a move. Oh, okay. Get out of the way. Don't take my goods. Oh, so tragic. Well, we'll go deal with that later. It doesn't seem like that big of a crisis, so... Um, just some petty theft. Heal up. Sweet. I was way more nervous about that than I needed to be. I maybe could have done one fewer level, but, uh, oh well. We're, we're happy with that. We'll take the win. You know, an hour and four minutes to beat the first gym and have this, this level of a team is, uh, it's not bad. I'll take it, so. And we've got two guys in the backup box. They can just be meat shields at some point, too, if I need that. That's another strategy I've used. Uh, let's go sell some stuff. 
I'll keep that spell tag for ghost type moves just in case. I don't I don't know that we'll need it, but uh, star piece. It's pretty good. Five five thousand bucks. Uh, so let's buy a few more potions since we only have like three. And we'll buy a couple more of those too. Alright, so that'll be good for now. Sweet. Onward. We'll go help that guy with his goods. Oh no. Bummer. Yes, I did help you. Yep, okay. Oh, we also want to switch so that we get someone else some XP because he's quite a bit ahead now. I'm debating whether I want Tony up front, but I think we want Pelipper for the next piece. Where did he go? Oh, he's in the cave. That's right. So we have to go all the way across. Forgot about that. A Kingler. So I did some grinding. And uh, I've killed both a Reggie Rock, which is very dangerous because they can one-shot me. Um, oh, hey. A friend with Geo Pals. Um... Should be able to one-shot him, even though we're weak to raw. It's a risky move. We'll try and one-shot it, and if we can't, then we'll switch out. I hope it can. Yeah, it... it okay. It crit to one-shot it, so... A little nerve-wracking. We'll switch, and we'll give C dot the XP. Just not take the risk with mine. Excuse me. Alright. Uh, Edo. So we know he can one shot it. And there's no risk because he's not weak to rock types. I just don't want to. I'm being super cautious, maybe. But we need Pelipper for the next gym really badly because of the wing attack. So that's going to be big. Yes, we'll switch again. C dot. Let's see. What level 1 is this? Level 8, okay. That's... If it were lower, I would have taken the risk with Pelipper. Although it doesn't look like they know any ground-type moves. Or not ground, rock-type moves. He's, he's immune to ground. Um, there we go. I don't know why he uses Mud Sport, because there's literally no way he can get hit by Electric-type. So, I don't know seems that's one that's never made sense to me oh hey uh you run a walk and pico's gone okay all right we'll get we'll get your bird oh this is also an encounter so we're gonna go get this item first lepa berry unfortunate i don't remember what that is in the base game but yep we do want to battle you Alright. Puchayina. Puchayina. Uh, we'll wing attack you. Yeah, cool. Should be able to two shot it then. That's pretty good. Nice. That's golden, level 11. We want to get up to about like 18 or 19, from what I recall, to battle those guys. Yes. Uh, yep. We had to steal some goods. Here you go. Thank you. Excellent. And then he'll wander on over, get his bird. Yep. And I'm just not talkative, I guess. So, I don't know. I don't know why they couldn't figure out to put the dialogue in there. I guess at that time they probably didn't have any way to, uh, to share what he was, or like what he was, what my name was? Ooh, a soul rock. Uh, let's try and get it. Yeah, we can weaken it like this. And that will be good. And we'll try and maybe put it to sleep if we need to. I don't know how good these are, but it's a fire type. So we'll just store it for 
her later. Age was talking to me about this, and he does not believe that fire types are very effective in this version, which is very fair. Um, all right, he's about as low as we need him to be, so we'll just throw. Up. I'll use up to three balls on this one. I don't really feel that strongly about catching it. Okay, yes. We should be able to, so I'll use one more here, and then if he can't catch it, we'll, we'll try and hit it one more time, because we should be able to get it lower to... Nope. Alright, let's try and put him to sleep, maybe, actually. Uh, no, we'll, we'll fight wing attack, because it shouldn't kill it, because he's super hardened up. Okay. Might even get one more in there. Let's try it. No, nope, no, nope, we killed it. Oh well. Uh, that's fine. It wasn't like a devastating loss. Soul Rock wouldn't have been that useful. Ooh, an another item. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Upgrade. I think that just, doesn't that just evolve? Peculiar box made by Silphco. Doesn't that just evolve, uh, freaking guy? What's his name? Um, I think it just evolves. Ooh, a Curlia. Can we one shot this? Uh, let's see. Yeah, nice. Good XP, because there's a tier 2. Yeah, give us that. 114. Um, I think that just uh, evolves a uh, polygon. Por Porygon? Polygon? Porygon. Porygon. Polygon is like shaped with multiples. A shape with some sides. <laughs> not, not the best. Not a, not a real name for a Pokemon. Alright. Level 11. Almost 12. Alright, this guy will give us something back, and then we can get out of here. Unless, is the Cutter's house in this one? I think it might be. It's a little emo, but we'll see. I've played through the beginning of this game so many times I should really know it, but yeah. And then he comes back just a second later, and the president wants to talk to us. He wants to talk to, like, this ten-year-old kid. It's a little creepy. I don't... Why do I already have, like... Oh, no, I don't have white hair. It's just a bandana. Okay. I always thought that was... His hair. Okay. Yep, we got the letter. We'll go give it to his pal Steven in just a minute. Yeah, cool. We got the Pokey Nav. And because he's a nice CEO, he gives us something in exchange. Um see this corporate scum later. We just need to seize the means of production and overthrow the bourgeoisie in reality, but oh well. Um, is the Cutter's house down here? This one? Yeah, we'll get the cut. And then we'll leave this city. Yes. We're a skilled trainer, yep. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Cut him up, baby gonna be a fruit ninja. Sweet. Uh, Alright, let's see. Is that a normal type move? Let's see. No one's able. Okay. Sweet. Moving on. Oh, hey, May. We don't battle you, right? Okay. Okay. Thank God. <laughs> I was like, I'm not ready! Oh, God. Well, I think we probably would be, because she has Cyndaquil, which is super convenient for us. All of our all of our friends will be pretty good against him. Um, we'll go on out of the Petalburg Woods over to Mr. Briny, and we'll sail off into the sunset before this episode ends, so that we can get going onto the next gym. Hopefully we can take that one on a little faster, because Pelipper is a little quicker to level. I'm so bad at getting him to talk to me. Okay, there we go. There we go. Yes, we did. Yes, we'd love to sail together. Okay, yep, let's go to Duford. And then we'll start the next episode in Duford. We'll be able to do some fishing. 
Um, we'll be able to go back to Petalburg and get an encounter there if we would like. Get a couple routes here too, so it's a good, good deal. Yeah. Just on his yacht. This rich old man. Alright, cool. I like that he like just owes us this life debt now, so. Alright guys, well that's our episode. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day or evening and catch you in the next one. Bye!